Hello and welcome to the Noble House Breath Challenge Day 10. Well done, you made it. Congratulations. <laughs> Today we're going to talk about goals. So we are going to breathe, but part of this session is about how do you want to move forward? What would you need to put in place to be able to take even the most baby step towards your goal? So you might want to first of all think about what it was that you liked best, which challenge you liked best and got the most out of, that was bang on where you're at now, and which ones you maybe found the most difficult, so that that's maybe where your growth edge is. And both of them are have got information for you. So once you have set your goal as to where you want to get to in your life, in your breath, um, the next step is to take a little tiny action towards that. So it may seem daunting and very far away, uh, but it doesn't have to be you need to get from here to there. It's all about how are you going to get from here to there. So what baby step, what one step, what one breath are you going to do in order to make a move towards the goals that you're setting for yourself in your life? And we here at Noble House like to think of ourselves as the cheerleaders in your baby steps. I like that analogy because if you imagine a baby who is learning to walk, each step and stumble and fall that they make is hugely applauded and celebrated and given such amazing acknowledgement. As adults, we don't really get quite such a rapturous applause for our failures or our less successful moments or our learnings. We have to keep going, pick ourselves up. With babies, they don't have to pick themselves up. They literally get picked up and put back on their feet and set to go again, ready for the next challenge, ready for the next baby step, with huge support. We at Noble House like to think of ourselves as being able to be part of that support and maybe playing a part in being that picking up. But if you're finding that you keep stumbling and it's really hard to want to try it again, that's a good time to maybe drop us an email. Drop us a shout. Yeah. Indeed. So we really do wish you all the best with all the goals that you set yourself. And we do hope that you found this breath challenge interesting and helpful in lots of different ways. We're going to pass over now to just do a little bit of breath and back to our candle from one of our other sessions to give you just a little bit of time to breathe in whichever one of the styles of the breath that really felt the most easy because it doesn't always have to be difficult right so first of all start off with the stuff that's easy and then drop in a bit mm -hmm. of the thing that's difficult rather than just keep trying to do the difficult one you can't already do so take the one that you really enjoyed doing the best we'll put on some music now and leave you to breathe for a little minute on that goal and the steps that you're going to make towards that. Except 
all the good for me I accept this times for me I accept what is I accept what is I stand tall as I go on my way I accept and I'm So gently bring your attention back to this video, let yourself find your grounding, open your eyes if you had them closed, go back to breathing in and out through your nose if you were doing it a different way, and just take a wee minute to collect your thoughts on what you came up with there, what goals you're setting yourself, big, small, whatever size, what steps do you feel you have in place? Which ones are you ready to take? Which ones do you need a bit of support and a bit of resourcing around? Take all of that information and this is the place to start. We are at the end of our breath challenge, but it is just the start of something new. It's been really good and enjoyable actually, and fun. We've had to put these things together. Yeah. So do watch out for more in the future, especially there's going to be an outtakes coming very shortly, <laughs> which, uh, yeah, we've, we've laughed a few times yeah. at ourselves. The main thing that I think I would ask you if you're going to take one thing away from all of the challenges that we've done is to be kind to yourself because it's amazing how difficult that can be and how much of a revelation it can be with that self-talk. So pick the thing that's nice for you. Pick being nice to you. And uh, from both Ali and myself, have a breath-filled, shiny, happy life. And we hope to see you here at Noble House soon in person. Thank you for joining us for this breath challenge. And congratulations to us all. Well done. I think it was quite a challenge, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cheers. Good job. Cheers. Bye-bye now. Bye for now.